Hi everyone, um, it's Wendy. Uh, welcome to my fashion video blog. And today's episode is... Ta-da! Shopping haul! Yay! I just wanted to share a few items that I picked up last week. And also maybe we can do some fun um, wardrobe uh, outfit mixing. And we'll see how that goes. Yeah! Okay, are you done? <laughs> okay, first up. Oh. oh my gosh, and we're gonna save the best for last. So I'm gonna open this one last. Alrighty. I got this sweater, um, and it's an All Saint sweater, and I got it on sale at Bloomingdale's for like 70% off, so it's a great deal. And All Saints just came over to the U.S., uh, the brand came over to the U.S. Like a few months ago, so they're still starting um, their sales, and I mean, they're just, the fit is just really awesome. I call this a grandpa sweater because it looks kind of grungy and old and vintage looking but it's really cool and I'm gonna do a separate episode where I will pair a few things with just this sweater alone and this sweater will be the centerpiece okay our next item ah I'm just so embarrassed to show you because it's, it's not very good looking. Um, I thought it was really awesome looking on the website, but when I got it, it was just kind of weird. What do you think? I agree. <laughs> it's, um, ah, I tried so hard making pairings using this sweater. I just couldn't do it. So if you have any suggestion for me, please let me know. Um, it's really oddly wide. It has like, like, it's kind of holy. You know, and it just wasn't too flattering. It feels really heavy because of the metallic uh, look to it and weight to it. So I really feel like I'm wearing a like a sweater made out of metal because it's just so heavy. So this is going to go in our return pile. I'm sorry, sweater. Another family would appreciate you a lot more. Um, okay. Alrighty. I, <laughs> this, I love fashion because you can be completely experimental and you never know what comes out of your combination and pairing. It might be really chic looking or it might be a real disaster, but you never know. And fashion is just about having fun and, you know, experimenting with things. So, in the experimentation spirit, being experimental, I decided to grab a pair of harem pants. I know they look like, I don't know what they look like. They look like diaper pants. They're really like, really like, you know, saggy but and they look, we never know. I'll try it on and we'll see what happens and it might be awesome or it might just be terrible and it'll go into the return pile, but you know, we'll experiment and we'll have fun. Um, and I'm actually going to do a separate episode just on harem pants. And I have a few recommendations to see if we can make this one work. Because they're in style and they're really comfortable, you know? So, we'll see. My next one is... Ah! Ta-da! <laughs> An aviator jacket. Um, she is my one and only. And... They are so on trend this season, and they were all over the walk, um, the runway last season. And I just think that an aviator jacket is such a classic piece to any closet. With any type of jacket, make sure that's well fitted, and it, it just will last you forever, you know? So, and I'm going to make an, a separate episode just on aviator jackets to see how many pairings we can do with this little baby. Alrighty. Are we ready for the last one? <laughs> I don't have my hair. <laughs> Ta-da. Okay. 
Christian Louboutins. Yay! <laughs> we caught this one in such good timing. We're at Neiman Marcus and it was on sale for 65% off. So it, it was really awesome. Um, it was my boyfriend's birthday and we were just walking around enjoying our day. And um, he actually ended up buying them for me on his birthday. It's super sweet. Okay, let's open it. Usually, I, I've only seen um, red dust bags. So it's kind of my first time seeing a white one, which is kind of cool. I'm a size four and a half. Um, I fit a size five in Christian Louboutins because they're actually cut more narrow. So I actually need a size up. Um, but these are so cute. They're just so cute. They're adorable. And they're espadrilles. And they have a leather wedge with a rope detail design. And it's a flannel leather front. They're just so adorable. I should be a hand model. I can just do this all day. Okay, so what I was thinking was, let's try and make a pairing out of just what we have now. See what that looked like. So, well, how does Conan do it? Like, <laughs> it's really weird. What do you think? I did not imagine pairing hair and pants with an aviator jacket and wedges. But I think it looks okay. You know, it looks kind of funky, looks a little casual. They don't look like a diaper pants, thank goodness, huh? And I'm gonna try to zip it up. Oh my God. <laughs> Nothing, I did not fall. The heels are actually very tall. They're like five inches. And I haven't worn them yet, so they have, they're slippery. Okay, okay. Okay, I want to try zip this. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. I want to try zip this up. See what kind of look we get. It's not too bad. <laughs> well, thank you so much for being with me today, and thank you for letting me share my shopping haul and what items I have. And please stay tuned for the aviator jacket episode and the harem pants episode. Bye.